Hi everyone and welcome to Knowable GCSE. So in this video I'm going to be introducing the Knowable GCSE marketing team. Now this is an entirely voluntary role but there are some perks which I'll be talking about later. So in this video I'm going to give you all of the volunteering guidance training and tell you how the logistics of this works if you want to help help Knowable GCSE grow. So I'm just going to give you a bit of information about me if you don't know this already, but you can skip ahead if you do. So I achieved all grade nines at GCSE level and I set my GCSEs a couple of years ago. However, I was predicted quite low initially and so had that academic comeback. And that's why I produce loads of GCSE videos because I feel like you guys are expected to know a lot of GCSE knowledge. So why are we as uh, teachers and helpers not expected to teach that many. So I'm trying to teach as much as I can. I want to help other students achieve their best and I'm passionate about free education. So I cover 20 different GCSE subjects. Over the next few weeks, I'm gonna be mass releasing them on YouTube. And this is where I need your guys' help. So for the YouTube aspect of No Waffle GCSE, I am making all of the content for the 20 different GCSEs from making the PowerPoints, doing the research to voicing it and releasing it. So I need your help and your expertise because I'm not too good at this at the TikTok, YouTube shorts and Instagram real side of things. So I need you guys who are specialists who understand how these apps work and how to draw people in um, to be working on this side of no awful GCSE. So how this is gonna work is they're going to be four teams for the Knowable GCSE marketing teams. You've got cinnamon, Belgium, potato, and chocolate. So they're all different types of waffles. And you can see some people's names on there already because they're the people who have volunteered quite early on. But if you want to join and you've just seen this video, then feel free to. You just have to email me, which is um, nowafflelearning at gmail.com. I'll put it in the description. And what, I will then send you is the password for the web page access to this, the Google Classroom codes, you'll be randomly assigned a team and you can start joining them. And if anybody needs to leave a team, then that is perfectly fine as well. The volunteering is approximately two hours a week, but I'll get more into that. Um, now, I'm gonna get into some really exciting things. Because you are volunteering, that typically means you don't get paid but I still want your hard work to be recognized. So we're going to have a little competition, the battle of the marketing teams. Um, you can see the order here. This is just a random alphabetical order, but ac across the weeks, the scores are gonna be changing. So how does this work and what is the main goal here? Well, the main goal for now all the way up until June 2025 is to achieve 100k subscribers on YouTube, followers on TikTok, so collectively we want to reach that many people. And the reason why it's by June 2025 is because that will officially be the third year of No Waffle GCSE running. So that's our overall goal, so how does this competition tie in with that and how does that work? Well, each team will produce a minimum of five TikToks or shorts per week. Now, you're gonna submit this via the Google Classroom to me. Every team will be ranked based off of the analytics of their content that they've produced. Um, so I can access this from my side, so looking at the views and the conversion rates. Now, this will be totally unbiased for me, and then I will, um, on a weekly basis, post the leaderboards. On June the 1st, 2025, the top two teams will receive a prize with first place receiving 180 pounds divided by the group and second place receiving 60 pounds. Now, I'm trying my best for this. I, I'm really low on funds and things like that, but I really want you guys to be rewarded for your hard work. And therefore, after June of 2025, there will be better financials so there might be some job opportunities for any of you students who've shown progress and a passion for our message. Now I'm going to answer some frequently asked questions and then we can get on. So how long should I volunteer for? as in per week. So it will be mostly man self-managed, okay, within your groups. So you could be in uh, Team Cinnamon and you guys all decide, okay, we're gonna, on, on a Sunday night, we're all gonna um, 
do a Google Meet or a Zoom or something and communicate about content strategies, different ideas. And then throughout the week, we can create those videos. Um, I approximated two hours per week because I think that should be enough for five amazing TikToks, but it's up to you, okay? It's volunteering, so it's your time. Next, how and when do we have to submit them? So each week you're going to have, as a team, up until Sunday 6pm to submit your five, minimum five TikToks on the Google Classroom assignment for your team. Now any video format is fine. And then the next Sunday, so as I post through them throughout the week, they will get their respective analytics. And then the next Sunday, I'll post the leaderboard results for that week, i.e. which of them did the best. And you can find this on the volunteers website page, which if you email me to become a volunteer, you'll have the password access for. And then you submit the next five by the next Sunday. How should we organize our team? Well, I said two approaches here. You don't have to follow them necessarily. The first approach is, okay, one person is gonna be the head of content strategy. They're gonna come up with all of the ideas for the video whilst the other members create the actual content, create the videography behind it. Or you can have another approach where you have weekly meetings, as I said, and everyone is brainstorming together. Everyone can then create two videos per week. Are there gonna be virtual meetings? Yes, there will be. So on Google Classrooms for the different teams, I'm gonna send out notices for meetings for different teams. Don't worry, don't be nervous, quite a nice person to deal with. So, um, and all it is is just discussing the progress, congratulating people I feel need to be congratulated, sending certificates for volunteering and writing your references, and just getting to know you guys. I'm not gonna critique you in the slightest. And this will be probably monthly for each of the teams. What are the guidelines of the content to make? Now, obviously you need to make it appropriate for the respective age group and don't be too political in any way. But at the same time, I um, invite things like funny political jokes or GCSC things. So just try not to make things that are offensive. Um, I have content about any of the 20 GCSEs that I cover. So I would encourage you to make videos on that or videos that make students want to check out No for GCSE channel. I'm not too good at this. So you guys have all of the ideas. Think about what students enjoy watching, what motivates them and try and make things like that. Am I allowed to show my face or voice in a video? So strictly, I don't want any of your guys' faces in the videos because I want you to be safe and you are under 18 anyway. And for the voiceovers, um, you can contact me whenever you want me to do any voiceover and I can just send it across. Um, but if you feel like your voice will be helpful and meaningful, then you can do that too, as long as I have your permission. Now, what if somebody leaves my team? That's okay, as long as there's at least three members in the team. Now you have to be strategic here because remember the prizes are 180 pounds for the first place and 60 for the second. So if you have more people, that means the smaller each individual winner gets. However, perhaps the better content generator. So find that balance. And finally, is there gonna be a team leader? Well, as I mentioned, everything is gonna be self-managed. So as long as a weekly deadline of five is met per week, you can delegate however you like. So email me if any questions you may have, or if you want to volunteer, do so. And best of luck to my noble volunteers. I'm so excited to see what happens. And again, contact me if you need to.